Good afternoon, Steve Lentini, Lord and Lentini, training for life and the best getting better. So today I wanted to talk about Leadership Gold and it happens to be one of the programs in the John Maxwell Mastermind trainings and um, something I'm certified for. And so in, in Leadership Gold, one of the things that are really impactful is to be modeling the behavior that you want to see. And what I see oftentimes is uh, managers and leaders micromanaging. They don't want to make any mistakes or anyone beneath them to make any mistakes. And they, they want things to be perfect. And so what happens is they set these really tight boundaries around how things have to happen. And so managers at lower levels aren't learning. You have to let go of your grip and let managers at lower levels work things out amongst themselves. Maybe even have a mentoring group where a couple of times a month or once a month, managers meet to help each other. You have to work to break decision making down to the lowest possible levels. That's how you grow leadership teams. That's how succession plans get filled up and you can quickly identify people to fill openings higher up the chain, the leadership chain. And so leaders, you got to let go. You got to let go a little bit. Loosen up the boundaries. Make the corral, so to speak, and the boundaries as wide as you can and let lower level managers interact with each other, make decisions, and keep certainly keep higher level managers informed. But there's certain things you shouldn't be involved with if you're in a higher level. You want your team making those decisions and maybe even making a mistake. It's okay. That's how everyone learns and grows. And you can set the boundaries higher and have people notify you. And then you have an opportunity to interject then. But let people go a little bit and let the reins go a little bit. That's where you'll find greater success. And a team that'll take over long after you're gone. Leadership gold. Remember it.